<laughs> My modest excuses, Grim. Right, the situation is that everything all got jumbled up in our fax delivery system. You should listen to your gut today. <laughs> your gut, yes, because you're a skeleton. Uh, you know, just go with the flow. Fade. Quota today. New CT scan machine design proposed by prominent radiologist enters the prototype staging. Exciting. Transglobal Inc. founder uh, dead at home, cause of death, drug overdose. Uh, investigators find plans for a massive surveillance system at the home of the dead tech wizard. Charity auction that takes place uh, at Enroll uh, Cosmosis. Bring your friends. Alright, I wonder what this guy has to say. Ronaldo Gilbert, 866, uh, 56, position producer, uh, producer designer. For decades, Ronaldo has been crafting some of the most creative and aesthetically. Isn't that the head of the game? Oh! It's the guy he wanted us to kill. Okay. He dies! Uh, Kermit Colt, age 58. Kermit! Uh, position, uh, psychologist. Kermit has a warm, kind heart personality and does their best to help troubled youth and marginalized people. They are community activists and run a private practice of cognitive behavioral therapy when they are dealing with their grandkids. He lives. I know I'm fucking up nature. I know, I know. I know, I know. Uh, oh. Marine St. John, age 26, this is an office assistant. Marine works as a fintech startup. The boss likes them because they always manage to organize fun team events on zero budget. At home, they dream of royalty on a, on a white steed, sweeping them off their feet while binge-watching environmental docs on YouTube. They love knitting and listening to post fortification bands. Okay, yeah. Well, at least I fixed, uh, nature a little bit. Nature. Okay. Who fuck's that guy? I haven't done him yet. Uh, Stefan Ashby, age 55, uh, position, uh, statist, st uh, stat, statistician. Stefan lives and breathes statistics. They work as a statistical consultant at several companies and give lectures at the university. Every time they get drunk, they start ranting about the misuse of p-values. He lives. Are you sure about that, bro? Yes. Are you sure about that? Look. Oh! He lives. Uh -oh. oh, peace if she lives. Money goes up, nature goes down, so he's got to die. Hold on. John Walker, soldier. You want a tiny thing fused to another tiny thing using an alloy toilet? You come to Jan. Sculpt. Sol soldering in a cornerstone of buildings, maintain uh, any modern technical equipment, and Jan is the best at it. He is going to die. Sorry, Jan. I want to protect nature. Please understand. Ah, oh, fuck, I read this guy. Uh, Jarl Igmar Olofsson, age 41, position market researcher. Jarl Igmar, <laughs> excuse me, is currently researching the soda market, hoping to find a new angle. It's make or break situation for Jarl as they're trying to provide for their family while succumbing to credit card debt. Their boss is thinking of firing them due to little results. Choice. Oh, environment. Health goes down, though. Okay, health's still there. Ah, shit. Uh, we gotta let him live. Death, it does worse for the environment. 
Oh! Wait. Where's that eraser? Grab our eraser. That's the only choice we got. He dies. So... Being a roadie sometimes is a thankless job. Money goes up, but environment goes down. He doesn't care, so... so he stopped giving a shit a while ago! Stop giving a shit. Oh, look, it's... Are your fingers getting stiff? Quite a while. Perhaps a short break is in order? Time, gather your wits, stretch a bit. The world won't explode if you step away for a second. Probably. What's the results so far? Are you just trying to convince yourself on the merits of your plan? Ah, uh, yes. This, this hypothetical plan of mine! Is, is death really such a bad thing? Such a bad thing?! It would be better, better, better for <laughs> everyone! Do these humans even truly exist? It is all transient, no matter what they do or achieve in life. They exist in a state of hubris and arrogance, considering that the center of the universe, yet without them, the sun still sets and rises. Stars explode, the galaxies form, or get torn apart. Departments in the bees. Humans are not the be all and all in population. They are small and insignificant. Yet full of themselves. The grandeur of everything will not get superseded by sex. It matters not how they live through their subjective experiences. Millions upon billions of them, everyone considering themselves unique. And technically they are, I suppose. He is also seeking a similar time. Copy of each other. Living through similar events with similar basic reactions. While the universe is full of dreamless wonders that cannot be of even a spirit that supports us. But why? What may that change? Their presence is not even necessary to validate these events outside their subjective experience or understanding. Do you know the saying? If a tree falls in the forest and no one is around to hear it. Yes. Imagine that. Life reduced only to some human extent. The ultimate height of arrogance and great To imagine their presence to be paramount. The tree does not only sound, it has been sound for a long time. It has grown without anyone. None of this requires humanity to be there to bear witness. Then you have much yet to learn. Good night, girl. <sighs> this fucking old man. Alright. This fucking guy!
We have very few incoming profiles for today. Something is quite amiss. Keep your wits up when you miss the dive with the bait. Beloved video game designer fatally poisoned at a toxic sludge spill. No tentacles found present. Rody for the Wilderness asked to join the band as a drummer after the end of the latest tour. Uh, number of armed conflicts decreasing, experts say. Uh, soda company starts selling uh, Mojito Rum Cola flavored sodas. Parents enraged. Editorial by youth uh, psychologists inspires anti-bullying movement. So we choose one person has to die. Oh god, they're both new. Okay. Olaf Rainer, age 35 designer. Music? Dogs? Drinking? Dream. You want it? What else, it's yours, my what friend. else can one hope in life? Olaf is one to enjoy the sweet life of a designer in a prestigious business IT company. They also enjoy making five second videos on the popular social media platform What What? TikTok. Is that doing anything? Oh! Oh no! Now well, that's a bad person to keep alive. The other one's gotta die. Emil Bonu, age 46, is a priest. Emil went to college in 19 to study religion for. The Louise, uh, when weighing career options after graduation, decided to become a priest again. For the Louise, some argue their detachment gives them the ability to give good unbiased advice to troubled souls. Only one person has to die! Nah, fuck me. <laughs> the fuck, bro? Dude, fuck this bitch. Yeah, I'll do my job whenever I fucking feel like it. Fucking Zach! <laughs> 